Yes guys, welcome back to the Thornton 100 Motorcycles YouTube channel. My name is Joe Lee and I'm here with our lead tech and my brother, Evan. And today we're gonna to be building two brand new Triumph Bonneville bobbers. Evan's gonna take the Stealth Edition and I'm gonna take the black and white one over here. You're gonna build it to what your spec, what you think is cool. Yeah. And I'm gonna build one over here to what I think is called my spec as well. And these bikes are both gonna be built for stock as well. So stay tuned to see what we get up to and let us know which one you think is cool. Race, bro. Race? Yeah. And, uh, no doubt about it, man. Huh? No doubt about it. I love emails to reply to. Now I'm waiting for Evan. So I just like. Get head start. Crack on. Yeah. Good start. You're going to see the difference between my way of working and Evan's way of working because mine is take everything off, put it all in one big pile, and then rebuild it from that pile. Evan's is take everything off, put it in a bag, put right on a, a tag on it and then see exactly where it go. Don't take my tools. Yeah, but it takes too long and I also know where every single bolt in this bike goes. Uh, Evan, where's my earth uh, strap? Well, it's moved my, 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 my clamp. Because it moved it to the other side, look. Me? Heads. <laughs> if it wasn't lost, how'd you find it? It was temporarily relocated by one of you boys just to prove a point. If we had a crane, we could lift the whole bike up. So me and Evan have been over at the warehouse and I printed off, before we just went, printed off a uh, pick list for both bikes and then we just went through, scanned everything on our phones, checked all that stock. So both bikes are very similar. In, no, it's not better though, is it? It's just different. Although I did spec mine up a little bit more than Evan, so mine will be actually more expensive. But I've basically gone dark, wide, low, so I'm actually gonna take Evan's factory special paint off of his bike, put it on my bike, because it is a nice, nice color. We'll change the decals on it, make it look sweet. And then mine's gonna have the auxiliary lights on, peer lights, chunky knobbly tires. Both gonna have spoked wheels, actually. So that'll be interesting. And then yours is gonna be, what, light color? Yeah, nice light. I ice green. That Porsche color. Ice green it is Porsche color. <laughs> Porsche just did the best colours. <laughs> Porsche does the best colours out. Everyone always kicks off and goes, Porsche. Okay, it's Porsche colour. It could be any make of car, but it's just a nice colour. Porsche are the best things. Best, cool. best colours. So, press some stems in, put some front ends in, uh, get some wheels on the go, get some exhaust rolling. Um, yeah. This isn't uh, this bit, you can't race on this bit. This bit's not rushed. This is, this is take time. This is the bit that takes time. And make it look. Bad boy. So uh, these uh, are bike up straight down. Yeah, that one so go on. Nice. Hold it Little down. logo. If you're doing these. Yeah, brush finished. Now there's two different types. Nice and short. Loads of sound. That's what we like. And then what else you got? This. Bottom yoke. Foot peg, high rise foot pegs. Those are good. Top yoke, titanium stem, uh, titanium front axle, titanium rear axle. 
Yeah, super logo on the end there. Something. Super lightweight. buttoned up and now I'm just going to test all the lights, indicators, uh, I'm going to switch it on because actually they are, the ECUs are locked when we get them, um, so if they were stolen they're absolutely useless and uh, yeah now I'm going to switch it on and then I'm basically done, I'm just going to watch Jody build his. Oh, you could drill my engine bars for me. Could I? Short and Vance and Hines uh, sinuses. Uh, they make a really nice noise because it will just sort of muffle it rather than the, the bark that they usually get with the twisted and stuff like that. Go ahead. 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 Smells like farts. Well, it smells like farts, Danny. Yeah, what is going on? <laughs> this paint looks so sick. My one's just pure fuck. Like, give me your money. My oh, bike looks like it'll pick you up by your ankles and shake you upside down, but hardcore. Ride it in the wet. Kind of vibe. My living room on Christmas, yeah. yeah, yeah. We bought some cake, yeah. Christmas Eve did a burnout. Maybe we can put that clip in here.
Jet, they're like the same bike, completely different sounds. This one's aggressive and loud, and it looks mean. Like it will bite your arm or your ankle. <laughs> Probably bite your leg off. Evan's a bit more sophisticated. Looks good. If you want to see even more behind the scenes, follow my personal account at Jody Millhouse. <laughs> Say when. <laughs> okay, so the bikes are all done and they both look absolutely fantastic. I think you'd agree that they both couldn't have turned out further away from each other really. I mean, they're both based on the same bike underneath. Both got V4 wide kits with the spoked wheels. Uh, but tell us a bit more about your bike. Uh, so yeah, I've gone for more of a clean road style look uh, with my favourite tyres, the Michelins, um, also the tyre decals as well. I think it's just pops really bright uh, with the ice cream metallic Porsche paint. Um, so yeah, and also the exhaust, I'm happy with that, it makes a lovely sound. So uh, yeah, how about yours? Makes it, yeah, makes a bit of a uh, smoother sound, doesn't it, compared to mine, which just absolutely barks and tries to rip your face off in your first rear drums. So I went with a much more aggressive look. Obviously we took the paint off Evan's bike and then we moved it onto my bike as well. So it'd be a shame to paint over that factory stealth edition as well, which is a bit of a rare color as well. So we've got the black paint that fades into the purple as you move back. We blacked out everything else, all the throttle bodies, uh, the throttle body covers, seat base, and then we went with a gripper style seat. Off-road style tire as well, no tire decals on these ones. Just keep that blacked out look. Auxiliary lights, the peer lights, they're mounted on the engine bars as well with a straight down pipe cut exhaust, which is absolutely fantastic. So let us know in the comments below, guys, which bike you like best as well. If you make any changes, maybe we'll take that into account any future builds that we do as well. We want to make sure that you guys are enjoying the content and the bikes as much as we do as well. So click that like button and make sure you hit the subscribe button. So many of you are not subscribed, so please hit that subscribe button. It really does help our channel and we'll catch you on the next one.